You're listening to Ashtrays and Action Figures on Detroit's own MNE Radio. Oh my god, that was absolutely great. Those guys sound great. Those guys sound great. What's up, y'all, and welcome back to another episode of Ashtrays and Action Figures. A special episode of Ashtrays and Action Figures. And action figures. Special! You can smell the sweat on Santa's balls. That's right. And tonight's episode is brought to you in part by Little Caesars. Try the new $8 hot and ready. Anasol depends undergarments and CF Burger Creamery tastes the best. So give it a try. We got a great episode for you tonight. Monoxide, are you ready? I'm ready. Man, look. We're doing something different because it is the goddamn Christmas episode. It's 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Well, it's 9.03. Well, it's at, yeah, actually, well, fair enough. It's probably 9.05 because we're we're not paying attention, but God damn it, we're doing something different. We're not going to the hotlines tonight. So don't call. What we're doing is we're taking over the internet world. Twitter, Instagram, right now, if you have holiday pictures, we want to see your decorations. We want to see you being festive. If you're fucking wrapped in Christmas lights right now from head, neck, breast, chest, toe area, Send it in. We want to see it. Hit us up on Twitter at Radio AAF or hit us up on Instagram at Ashtrays and Action Figures. We want to regram and retweet those goddamn pictures of you being festive. Motherfuckers and motherfuckers. I just want to see your trees. Yeah, fuck yeah. Uh, I want to see how you're doing it. Do it. I want to see the festive. I want to see your festivities. Yeah, not those kind of trees. Well, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> right. But still, it's the holiday. It is the season. <laughs> Tis the season. And they say be jolly, but I say be whatever you want. Right. If you, you don't have be, to conform. You don't have to. You don't have to if you want to, but there's a lot of there's a lot of really cool shit going on and reasons for you to be happy. If you want to be a Christmas dick, <laughs> be a Christmas dick. <laughs> Put your Christmas dick away. There's a lot of reasons to be hype, and I got a few of them right here, right now. Did you know about tonight's episode? Are, me? Yeah. I know. Uh, yeah. Well, uh, can we tell them? Can we tell them some of the shit that we got going on for them tonight? Uh, just, just, a, just a little. A little. Yes. Okay. Look. Yeah. We have no. a special interview with Blaze going on tonight for you. We have the top five Christmas presents in the world. Gift ideas, presents for your fucking face in the world going down tonight. We also have celebrity five questions with the one, the only, the incomparable Santa Ronald Claus. Christopher Kringle Reginald Christopher Kringle. Reginald Kringle. God damn it. I call him Reggie. <laughs> Motherfucker, he is here. He will be here with us tonight. Well, he is not here yet. He is probably in a sleigh or doing whatever Santa Claus does. Doing Santa Claus is in the dr- fucking green room right now getting wasted. He is. He has been eating gingerbread cookies and doing eggnog shots yeah, since he Yeah, he brought he got his own here. eggnog. So I don't know what's in it, but we have other stuff for you too. We also have a very special rendition of the immortal holiday classic, The 12 Days of Christmas. You're not going to want to miss out, so don't log off. Log on. Stay logged in. <laughs> not a log. Not a log. Like you think I said a log. <laughs> I said log. You can't. You can't. Don't be mad because I said log. Stay logged in and log on and fucking enjoy what we have for your faces. It's going down. It's Christmas. Do you have your Christmas tree set up, Monoxide? I have my Christmas tree set up since uh, late July. No, come on. Late July? Straight up. I'm a Christmas fanatic. He is. Jeez. I am the Clark W. Griswold of this generation. Oh, come on. I'm telling you. I literally had, I, I, I'm, I'm probably going to put mine up tonight after this broadcast because I'm so fucking festive right now that I'm just doing fucking kick steps and I want to make snow angels in the ground, but I don't have any snow. So I'm going to take this paper shredder and I'm going to empty it all over the ground and I'm going to start making snow angels. That's why I love it this year. We don't have snow. It's not cold. It's been 50 degrees. Look at that. Look fucking at that. love it. Look at that. I love it. Beautiful. There's pee on those papers. Come on. I'm, they're on my face. That's Melly Mel's little toilet oh area. Oh, my God. It's getting disgusting. <laughs> Come on, no. No. Who on you for peeing on these papers? No. Now I got it all. That's stuck to my eyelid. Jesus Christ. That's disgusting. All right, look. But, no, I'm in the festive mood. I'm feeling better about it as, 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 as it gets closer. I think that's what happens. I think that... 
The holiday season comes about and as stores, more stores and more of society starts to decorate, I think it brings you in. It's starting to bring me, it's, it's festively bringing me in, Monoxide. It's like an anchor to me and it's bringing me to shore. I live it all year round. I, I wait for the world to catch up <laughs> December 25th. I can't be like that. My life is Christmas. I love really? it. That's, yes. You love Halloween. The I way do. you love Halloween, I love Christmas. I can, I, okay, see, I can't hate. I can totally relate on that. That's a really, really good thing. I like getting gifts. I do, too. If I if I didn't get stuff on Christmas, I, I, I wouldn't gifts, like it as much. But your gifts on Halloween are candy. I don't really like candy. I like oh, cakes yeah, and pies. We need that holiday. If you well, all right. So happy next time, cakes and pies. Next time on Halloween, when you say trick or treat, we're putting full on cakes and pies in your bag. We got little hostess, little little Debbie snap cakes for you, man. We're gonna get them. Whoa! Wait Way a minute, better. they're shooting at us. I'd rather that than a a Mary Jane. Fair enough. No, yeah. Or a you pack know, of Starburst. I, all right, let me let's let's segue into this. Let me ask you this. Now, with the holiday snacks that are going on there, have you seen any of them in the new stores? I have. They and are, uh, everything is pumpkin flavored. It's a lot of spice and nutmeg going on for the right. holidays. They're spicing up the cat litter with pumpkin spice. Right. I've seen ketchup, they pumpkin got, <laughs> spice. <laughs> Why in God's name do you need pumpkin spice and ketchup? I don't know. I don't know either, and I don't want to know. I'm scared by that. But they have these Christmas trees, and they dip them in this frosting, and there's like enough fucking sugar on these goddamn things yes. to fake your fucking straights curly and your curly straights. That things are disgusting. And I I don't know why, but for some uh, reason, they give you the too much, and I gotta call it breaks on that because I'm getting sick. <laughs> it's just too much sugar. No, they look cool. They do look cool. But they taste like but shit. But they taste like shit, right? There's no peanut butter in any of them to be found. It's all sugar and just cake. That's why I love Christmas, cake, man. It's cake, all cake, about cake, cakes and pies. Cakes it is, but, it's, pies. but if you're gonna... You, don't you start crying at me now. You hold it together. We got more reasons to be festive. It's gonna be a fucking exciting show. You know what? Do, do you wanna do you wanna go? You want you wanna you wanna lift their spirits up there's right now? There's food. There's eating. Oh, you, oh, yes, yes. You get to, like, chew stuff and swallow it into your belly. <laughs> it's so amazing. It, it is. It is a good time. Well, that's it's, it's kind of like reminiscent of Thanksgiving. Or, you get or to cook I should say, Fat it. Kids Thanksgiving. That, you know, we that had was renamed there. it on the last episode. Let us not forget. We won't touch Christmas, though. We, no, there is nothing wrong with Christmas. No. For those of you out there wondering if we even thought we were going to even go near the little baby Jesus in the manger. Dare we never know, never we know, never know. I like my Jesus as I a baby too. with the, like a baseball hat that has like the dreadlocks right, on it and like right. a Rasta shirt that shows that he, you know, he's there. He's holy, right. but he gets down, man. He, oh, okay. He gets down, man. Yeah. Like it, my Jesus smokes pot, man. Fair enough. I, I feel you. <laughs> my Jesus collects toys, there and you I've go. got your back. Yeah. See, that's dope. You can go ahead and you can like stuff, because that's what we're doing here right. tonight on Ashtrays and Action Figures. We're getting festive, and we're kicking ass for motherfucking the holidays. What is your Jesus like, people? Yeah, you know. We, hashtag it. Hashtag it right now. Jesus and let likes. us know. On Twitter, at Radio AAF. We want to know. Hashtag what Jesus like. My Jesus likes pop, man. My Jesus likes action figures. There you go. I want there to it know. Is. No, change the hashtag. Yeah, change hashtag, the hashtag. Hashtag right now. Wait. Hashtag my Jesus likes. Hashtag my Jesus likes. Whatever. And then then, One then thing. space it. Then space it. And then write your shit. One thing. Then hashtag your shit. Because we want to see that hashtag my Jesus likes trending right now. Do not take a picture of your shit and right. draw a hashtag on it. Right. Thank Don't you. do that. You will ruin Christmas. Thank you, and you're welcome all at the same time. Do I, not blow this for us. I really, like, I, I really <laughs> want to hear what people deem the it. five gifts. Yeah. From, from here to Bulgaria, these are the five. I think I know them. Do you really? I think I know them. Now, I'm usually lot, really good at this. There's a lot of hype that's been floating around with a lot of gifts out there. And I think that people, you you may know a few of them. A few of them are pretty much nope. easy calls. I know them all. Uh, not, I don't know. I don't know. All you'll, right. All right. You'll look. see later. Well, you'll see. Monoxide is claiming that he knows the five. This is what we're going to do. We're going to break right now. We're going to kick you down with some motherfucking twisted holiday music straight out the motherfucking archives Fuck right yeah. here, right now on Ashtrays and Action Figures. And when we come back damn we're gonna go straight into the top five i smoked the whole thing i didn't Christmas know if you wanted present. to hit it or not man I, I, you know what 
That's uh, fine. I'll roll another one. We're going to go to a break. Yes. You can roll another one. All right. We'll come back. Top five Christmas presents in the world. Happy holidays. <laughs> A murder city Christmas. Hell yeah. That's the old school shit right there. A God murder lit. city Christmas. I just want to do it one more time. Still doing it. Man, damn. Damn, 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 damn. Jingle bells. Jingle bells. We jingle man. all the. Now, hold on now. Don't puke on me just yet. Now, when we said before our break. My Santa likes to drink. We said, hey, uh, my Santa likes to drink too. And smoke a little cron dogs, little cream crons. But a little Christmas crumb. Hashtag my Santa likes. Yep, we want to keep it going now. We want to start if you hashtag my Santa likes. And my Santa likes to get asshole white boy wasted. What? 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 Until he's got the shit until New Year's. What? That's how it rolls. Hey, Damn. hey, hey. Make sure that you hit us up at Twitter at Radio AAF and get that shit going. Hashtag my Santa like and then let us know. Hashtag what, what your Santa like and then hashtag what he what he. I'll tell what he you like. what he don't like. He don't like getting shot at. Hey, motherfucker. Well, you better duck down, Santa, because these motherfuckers are shooting that You're damn shooting. fight. Rudolph is down. Hey, I think, uh, I think Rudolph he's dead. was drinking. He died. He left <laughs> Bowles gone oh dead. He took one right to the jugular. <laughs> Listen, before <laughs> we took the break, we said that when we came back, we yes. were going to get into the top five gifts yes. of all time. So, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, we have an intro piece. Let's play that now. There can only be five of them. They're the top five Christmas gifts of the year. Lay it on me. Okay. And, 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 and that we spare no expense here at Ashtrays and Action Figures. Never. Especially on a Christmas special. Okay. That being said, here we are now. We have the top five gifts. Now, do you want me to start backwards? Let's let, let's let's start backwards. I'm going to tell you what they are. You're going to tell me what they are. And, and then you you're going to tell me if I'm right, which I will be, I'm you sure. Had, you had a way that you wanted to do this. Yes. Okay, coming in at the number five position. At Monoxide, number five. What do you think it is? Without a doubt. Uh-huh. Is pheasant feathers. Um, no. Pheasant feathers. No. No? No. Why are they both? Don't fucking boo me. What the fuck? Listen. You're, I don't think anyone would have ever gotten this. According to my list that I have, it's touch screen gloves. Apparently, one of the new trends going around, coming in at the number five position, is gloves that you can actually activate your phone. You don't have to take them off. Oh it's cold my out God. there. It's cold out there, and you get that call. You're shoveling that lawn. Can we not talk to each other anymore? Come on. I'm not saying that I want a pair of these, but I can understand why they would be in the top five position. I don't, think so. I, no, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure. Number I, four. Number four. Uh-huh. 100% without a doubt in my mind is the new cylinder suede shoelace. What um, the fuck was that? <laughs> no. They're booing me again. Number this, four. Fuck? Coming in at the number four slot, it is smartphone projectors according to my list. I was close. I, I, you were. You were tentatively close. Again, another nifty, trendy kind of thing that's going out there. You can hook up a projector to your phone and play your oh, wow. your shits on the wall. That's awesome. Like, I, it is a really cool gift, and I didn't know about it until we made up the list, and uh, now I kind of want one. So, uh, hoink. That's interesting. All right. I'm cool. O, I'm all for two. I'm all for two. All right. Number Let me tap. Three. I'm going to tap into the world. Tapping into the world. Tapping into the world. I have it. Cat sweaters. Cat sweaters. Yeah, sweaters. The God, I swear Ooh, to God, no. I will find every one of those <laughs> no. motherfuckers Why booing us, listen, and I will. I, it, you will get a cat number, sweater. Number three. I don't know how this made the list, but number three, according to the list, the number three of the top five gifts ideas are is it actually drones. What the fuck? I don't is a know drone? how or why, but drones. Oh, Apparently, like the flying thing? Yeah, little That's flying, dope. little flying camera operated drones. So I guess you can. Uh, the perverts. Yeah, I suppose. Right. I suppose it. Yeah. It, it, it doesn't seem like a very um it seems yeah I, i'm not not sure i like number three now, at listen, all i'm not saying i like it you but, can uh, go and you can buy one of them right uh-huh and if you fly it over by me and it's on my property i can shoot it out of the uh, sky i don't know hey man and i will true. do said thing so but that I, I would take yeah i guess i take that over a, a over sweater a, with a cat on it or okay. a fucking pair of isotoners right uh, yeah i, I, I mean, don't know right, about fair the glove enough. Thing. okay Number two. What do you believe number two to be? 
just going with my gut. Uh, you're not even going to go with the curve. You're not even going to go with society. No, nope, even I'm the, going with, even with the, my gut because I am in tune with the people of today. And oh I know for a fact goodness. it is a ribbed Trojan 12-pack. Yes. Oh, you motherfucker. <laughs> I swear to God. Uh, you are virtually um, two for you, one, two, three. You've gotten all four of them wrong right. so far. Cool. Um, according Jeez. to the number two slot on the top five gifts right now happening is Star Wars. Star Wars, Star oh, Wars. Oh, blow anything, it out your ass. Anything Star Wars is the hottest gift right now oh, going on. Uh, the BB-8 droid, the interactive Yoda are amongst the Star Wars wow. mania that's happening right now. People are dressing up as we speak and getting in line to see a movie that is... Uh, it was supposed to come out on Christmas. Uh, that, they yeah. changed the date. No, I believe it's in theater. Is when they it, first start playing the trailers, isn't it? Isn't no, it I think it's the tonight? 18th. I thought it was. I'm not sure. They're I don't have my line. fucking. Are they? Can we? Can we find out? I don't have my Jedi robe on right now. Okay. We, yeah, he doesn't have but his Jedi robe on right now. When they but first, I think people are in line for it. It's a hot thing going on right now. It is. When they played that trailer, it said important. Christmas. Important. The number one thing this is probably the easiest of them all what do you think the number one gift idea in the world in the world is right, right now. now then i would i'd be willing to say that seven out of ten people absolutely have this on their list okay are you ready i am indeed dustin are you ready no i'm ready. fritz okay. you there here we are we're all there right a prostitute yes Oh, why are the boobs? Son, Son of a, a bitch! My I swear to God, point him up. Hey, man, I'm, I'm not saying that you don't have a good idea on what you think it should be, but I honestly, I'm gonna go with the list, and they're saying that the number one fad that is going on in the world right now is hoverboards. All right, Any hoverboards. and everyone, they they are selling them at, at kiosks mm. in the mall. You're the, right. The the the, the Instagram is my selling friend. them. My um, friend. They're selling them in Kroger's. Everywhere, everywhere you turn, they are selling hoverboards. And and it is like the biggest fucking uh, uh, trendy thing happening right You're now. Right. So that is like the number one Christmas gift to be supposedly under said Christmas trees. This year, there is the top five fucking Christmas gifts. I'd rather have the prostitute. In the world! He wants the prostitute wearing the fucking touchscreen gloves and dressed up like the interactive Yoda while flying on a drone. I'm not banging Yoda, dude. You're nuts. Ooh. That hey, is man, not he my... He is a goddamn Jedi! That is not my country. You will show him some fucking respect! <laughs> I'll respect him. I will not bang him. Okay, fair enough. You got a point. I wouldn't bang him either. Yoda can't fuck with this. We also... Ah. <laughs> <laughs> my God. No. There's Yoda backing it up. Oh, oh my, <laughs> oh my no, God, that just happened. I, Listen, I agree with some of those things do, on that list. Do, we, I don't agree with the gloves. Fair enough. I don't no. agree with the gloves either, but I can understand how people can get behind something like that because they want they don't want their hands to be all chapped. God damn it. I swear, I'm telling you right now, if I see you standing out somewhere with those fucking gloves on, he's slapping, texting, you know it. He's I'm slapping, slapping. You better have a waterproof phone on yep. you because he's slapping your phone out of your hand. Now yep. you're going to go have to fish your phone out of the big ass snow pile that he slapped. The snow drift. He slapped your phone into yep. you. Now and you I'll be long your... gone by the time you get up, so don't even try to chase me. Now your hands are wet. Yes. Because you dug into the snow drift trying to get your phone back. Talk to people. We had honorable mentions too uh, uh, for gift ideas. Really? If, if you're yeah, if you're out there and you don't know what to give that person who who just has everything or has nothing and you have no idea, adult coloring books. Those are actually. It's I've a, never it's, heard of it. I've a, seen those. It's a strange like, idea, but I, I can see how it could keep people uh, uh, occupied. I've and, seen uh, the Harry Potter ones. That's interesting. And no, it was I like twenty five bucks. I love it. I think it's great. I get, I get all, I get, you know. All it looks fucking... more like a smaller version of those ones you can get out of the Walgreens, the Absolutely. felt ones. Yeah, no, but that's it's dope. not felt, but it's detailed like that. Absolutely, Sorry no, I love it. I love that. it. <laughs> um, obviously, gift cards always work, and um, Beats by Dre wireless headphones mm -hmm. are all three dope ass. Um, Honorable mention gift ideas to get that someone who I might have put some of those in my top five. I don't know. Uh, right, right. I'm know. saying. I, I you know got what a mean? problem with the gloves, if man. We, the gloves are weird. I can't the gloves let are it go. Weird. I, yeah, they're they're kind of strange. I'm not going to say that they're not kind of strange, but uh, I cannot let it go. Was the top five list? If you here, you know what? Let's do it again. Let's take what? to the Twitter one more time at Radio AAF. Yeah. Want you to kick off hashtag top five gifts and kick me down. Five's a lot. Okay. Do three. No, no, I just, I just want him to hashtag top five, and then I want you to give me the number one. Ah, just right. I'm sorry. Just, just, just put hashtag See? top five gifts, 
and then put hashtag and then fill in your number one answer. Whatever you think the number one should be. We want to know. I feel like we, we a Christmas know. ass, man. No, that's fine. I no, jumped I it. fucked it up earlier. No, you know, I it's it. It's cool. But look, check it out. We want to keep the shit popping. We want to keep the shit going. We want to. Do you want to do? Do you want to do the interview with Blaze? I'm kind of excited. I, I want to do that. I want to talk to Blaze. We got some important stuff to talk to him about. He has a goddamn record coming up. He does, did I watch the FedEx truck pull into yes. the lot of Street. Magic Ninja yes. Entertainment Street. and yes. unsheathe them? Yes. Like the th- what? What? Not, not his sword. Who is it? Uh, Lancelot's sword. Uh, yeah. I was gonna say Thor's hammer, it's, but it's not really sheathed. Excalibrate. Is it sheathed? Excalibur. He unsheathed it from said rock. Does, Sh- does Thor sheath it? Um, no. He, well, he's he got a hammer. Go ahead. Say he Thor sheaths it three times fast. Thor so, so sheaths it. Right th- off the bat. Th- Fuck! See? Go ahead, Dustin. Thor, Thor sheaths it. Th- yep. No. You bad. No. See? Shit's Thor sheaths it. Thor sheaths it. Yeah. 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 That's what it came out like for me. Right. That was bullshit. Yeah, let's... Right, uh, listen. Yeah. Let's get so, Blaze on the phone. All right, we're gonna get Blaze on the phone. I'm sure um, he's got a lot to talk about, man. Let's, yeah, hell yeah. Let's uh, let's do that. So we'll be right back after this with Blaze, the dead homie, right here, right now on Ashtrays and Action Figures. It's all ringing. Right. We are live back on Ashtrays and Action Figures. About to talk to the one and only, my dead homie, your dead homie, Blaze, your dead homie, Christopher. Ronaldo. I hope he answers. He's not going to pick up because he doesn't know the number. Yo, what up? Hey, Maybe what's he's up? pooping. Are you Blaze? Po- wait. Oh, all right. He's here. He's here. Yo, he's here. with us now. Do you have time what to up? talk to us, Blaze? Yes, sir. What up? Uh, what's up, man? How what you up, doing bro? tonight? Oh, you know. Say third poops. He's, hey, <laughs> hold on. He's not Checking pooping. Checking my dogs out, and that's exactly what they're doing. Third, third poops. Yeah. All right. Well, 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 hold on. So... <laughs> So look, what we wanted to do was we wanted to take a little time out of the special Christmas episode of Ashtrays and Action Figures to do a little interview with you and talk with you a little about uh, a little bit about your upcoming release, The Casket Factory, that's coming out January 15th. We know that you have a yeah. release party the same day at the Odeon in Cleveland. We know all this. We want all the listeners to know about this, but we want to talk to you about it a little bit. Yeah. Um, Okay, first and foremost, we know that every time somebody brings out a record, we, they always say it's the greatest, it's the best record they've ever done in their life. and, and right. But nobody right. ever asks them why. But yeah, right. Great great point, Monoxide. So, so Monoxide wants to know, do you feel that way, that this is your greatest record to date? And if so, why? Why is said feeling yeah. emoted? I'm going to say that it definitely is my greatest at record today, and the reason why is no, I mean it, it is. It's my best record. And <laughs> yes. it's probably the best record today because the production wise is just uh, off the charts. Awesome, it's the best it's ever sounded. And uh, you know, like I said, since Pro Tools were uh, actually invented, I don't think we we were correctly using them until this day. Now, we're, I mean, maybe me, maybe I wasn't using them correctly until now. So, Interesting. Yeah, I mean, you'll hear that. As you listen to this project, who do you have produced? What kind of producers you got on there? Who's making the beats? Uh, Seven and my man Dead Beats, and then of the Dead Beats. I'm sorry, my man Seven and my homie Fritz does a couple of tracks here and there. Okay, that's what's up. Yeah, yes, sir. A nice collection. And uh, and 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 I got uh, the privilege of of uh, working on some stuff with you too. So I know (coughs) I know a little. I know I know I know a lot about it, a little bit about it. But uh, um, like I was gonna say to uh, to to add into what my you fully, bro. What I'm saying. uh, Listen, what I'm what I was gonna say is I want I want people to understand also that it's a. it's 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 a new sound for you as well. It's 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 a yeah. it's a it's a whole new blaze that that everyone's getting ready to experience. I think Brand I think new. that's very important that everybody knows that. So, Not in just looks alone. It's sound as well. A hundred percent new brand new flavor. You know, uh, yeah, so sure, just brand new stuff completely. A couple of different styles here and there. For sure, so, for yeah. sure. Really good uh, uh, story wraps. Now, word on the street is that it comes with a small Caesar salad. Is that true? Hey, no. Whoa, That's not whoa, true. Whoa. No. All right. But, 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 double up. but, and friends. but what All I right. do know, what I do know is that if you pre-ordered it here at Twisted Shop, 
you get an autograph exclusive version. Oh, that that's correct, awesome. Which is very cool. And there were a lot of really other dope pre-order options that were ran yes, through uh, TwistedShop.com as well that were pretty, pretty fucking amazing. So I hope that uh, a lot of people took advantage of those opportunities. I don't know if they're still available. Um, they are. You, they are? You better stop slipping. Hey, right, right. Stop coat. slipping, stop sleeping, and then get your fucking yeah. Christmas socks on and fucking walk over to the computer and so, fucking log on and log in and fucking check out some dopeness. So just to be well, clear. He popped a coat, man. Right. Hey, bundle six, man. Fuck yeah. Wow, he knew a bundle number. Right. Bundle six. <laughs> bundle, bundle six. And salad is not included in any of those. No things. salads just, are included. I want to be clear. No. He wants to be wants to be very, very I specific be clear. and clear. There's a vinyl included in one of them. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, okay. your first vinyl, yo. Let's vinyl talk option. about that. Let's talk about that. How does it feel now to actually finally, for the first time ever, and if correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think I am, but how does it feel for the first time ever in your whole musical career to actually have a, a full-on vinyl record? Oh it, man, awesome. Is awesome. that is that Thank cool you. or no? And and, and yeah, it's yeah? Exciting. It's like I've always been out there trying to scratch on them CD. Machine, right, right. And actually put on the real vinyl and just be out there like a real DJ. And that's cool because uh, me and Renox were talking about that how how it's 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 pretty cool how it's coming back and it's becoming like a collectible hobby and people are really getting into vinyl and collecting it and. And and it's me just, and Jamie were out in the back having a fucking fight with the freak show ones. We're, we're yeah. throwing them around like goddamn frisbees. I get nicked in the iris it's with insane. one of them, with the Whoa, with the bro. with the gatefold of one of them, and it just it blew my I, I it blew my whole entire thing out. It did. Okay, I'm I'm actually seeing right now. It looks good. Bundle right? six. Wait, what is this? Scroll this is, up. It's the oh, he's showing me all of the bundles. The pre-orders. Oh yeah, the pre-order bundles. Still yeah, no. Up. Very amazing. I still yeah. and and I have to compliment on the uh, whoever's idea it was with the die cut casket poster. Absolutely amazing. That that that's a really cool image. And uh yep. and, and yeah. That's so sickness. so don't sleep on the record. Um, Any videos for the record? Yeah, yeah. Talk about that. Say it again. Any videos for the uh, upcoming record? Oh man, hell yeah, we're already started. I'm trying to do multiple videos, but I'm already awesome. going to be on multiple because. I'm working on another one in a couple of days. I'm, I'm just getting done with worm food. Wow. As we speak. Okay. So, and I'm working on uh, one a few days ago, maybe a week ago, with ROC and Lex. Holy shit. For, they call that gangster. Wow. Nice. You know, That's we awesome. Do multiple. We should play that. Let's play Let's, that. All right. Yeah. We'll when, play we're, that. when we're done with this interview, we're actually going to play that song live for everybody yes. so for them to uh, actually get a taste of all the new right, record. Last question for me. Just for Fair me. Enough. Now, Fair do enough. you have that little glove on your hand in the bag for the dog so when they poop on the neighbor's oh. lawn, you got to clear? Or do you just tell them, fuck off? <laughs> See, I mean, look, back in the day... Right. It, was, it was sufficient where you were supposed to be out there with that bag. Right. And I live close enough to the country where I just let them shit wherever the fuck they want. Right. Wow. Nature's wow. for the wow. like Into the grass and it's all gravy. Fair it's, enough. I was going to say. If I no had to bet, I'd say no, you don't have it. I, I, you right. know, and, and I was just going to jump in there and just say, back in the day, nobody ever picked up any dog shit. Right. They never did. But we you lived in a fucking. W- that's That's not how it is in the suburbs. They will Fair not, enough. You know what I mean? They don't play that shit. Right. Fair enough. No, they they like, do not. Down your they they strictly do not right. play that sure. shit. You are absolutely they right. They want to put your dog to sleep because it took four <laughs> shits. Right. Hey, who's dog shitting over here? Right. Right. You're going to pick that up? Here's Somebody a bag. Did it. You didn't Damn bring it. a bag? Here's a bag. Here's right. a bag. Right. And rightfully, you should. Rightfully. If your dog goes and shits on somebody's lawn, you should have to clean it up. One time. That's not fair. I'm going to tell you a really quick story. One if your time, kid up. came over and shit on my fucking dick, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know, you get me. Yeah, I get You that. get me. I get right. It. No, I totally get it. Yeah, that's fucking All crazy. Right. All right. So check it out. So for those of you, now you know. If you didn't know, now you know. Blaze Your Dead Homie has a new record coming out, yep. The Casket Factory, January 15th. Run out to the record stores and pick it up. Write it backwards on your forehead and Sharpie so every morning you wake up and brush your teeth. You do not forget that date. January 15th. Yep. Are you touring for this record? Oh, yeah, for sure. Nice. Yes. I'm trying to get out there in February. I'm actually, they're booking dates right now. Oh, wow, that is very sudden. All right, so check that out check sweet. out Blaze at, uh, on Twitter at, at Blaze Your Dead One. Shout and, uh, out your social media. Yeah, shout them out. Shout them out. Oh, Blaze Your Dead One. 
uh, on Twitter. I'm Blazing Dead One on Instagram. Right on. I'm Blazing Dead One pretty much everywhere. Also, you got it across the board. Facebook, Damn. the whole nine. That's nice. It, that's that nice to have nice. that. It is. Because we have one. We have so, yeah, number one. Not we're not O N E, but well, not the, right, number, the number, the numeral one. one. Yes. Blaze yes. your dead. The numeral one. Very important. Yes. So so so. Somebody sure. right now is like, how do you spell numeral? Right, right. Right. Like, God damn it. Man, it's but not make sure right. make sure to keep up with Blaze on all the social media so you can find out when it. Make sure you keep up with him so that you can check out when he's coming to your neck of the woods and putting it down and bringing the casket factory to your door. I lied. I lied. One one more more, question. One more question. Okay. Okay. Hashtag your Santa likes. Yes. Fill in that. Yeah. My Santa likes. Like my Santa likes to get asshole wasted. Until he's hung oh, over until my, New Year's. And my and 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 my Santa, hashtag my Santa likes gingerbread cookies and shots of eggnog. Right. And it's a bitch Damn, who gets kicked in his nuts. Hey! <laughs> I'm just Whoa. playing. What happened? <laughs> he was a mall Santa. He just, he just got off of work. He didn't, he didn't deserve even do that. He didn't deserve that, man. Well, I harsh. better just... My Santa shows up <laughs> like a drunk. He is he is usually wasted, what but happened? he's real skinny. And he, he climbs in the, your chimney, but he's not dropping off presents. He's actually taking them. That's awesome. Oh, oh he, he, he leaves he, you with that. And he's leaving you with that. Oh, oh man. That's my Santa. Well, I mean, hold on. Before his I leave Santa. Look, I got one last thing. I was, okay. This is for monoxide. I, what this creed? I see C R E E D. Who the hell is that? The only creed I know is Apollo. He's still there. He just died. And Rocky Three, I just seen it like two months ago. What's going on, bro? Rocky went. S- Rocky had sex with Apollo's wife. So they right. had what this the- one. What the fuck? My this- ring got died. This yes. is this is the son of Apollo, and now Pencil. he is resurrecting the career of one punch drunk Balboist. Man, you know more about that movie than I ever thought you would have. And I don't have to oh, see it because I just up. seen the commercial <laughs> and I know enough to at least we can have drinks and I can keep up and I don't ever have to watch it. And on at that least note, somebody knows. Oh my god. That's why we all love it. <laughs> Thanks for taking the god time to talk man. with us, Blaze. We appreciate you. Yes. Don't forget, check out his new record January 15th, The Casket Factory. Fuck yeah. 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 All right. Don't make clean that dog shit up too. <laughs> oh, you hit him with the dog shit. All you right. can't do that, man. That's not right. Hey, now he can't it's rebut. time. But no, hey man, it's okay because right. no, he actually lives out in fucking Timbuktu, so he, he doesn't have to clean up the dog shit. I'm You're just right. mad because I have to clean up dog shit, and I don't even have a dog. So two dollars, I come back clean who- all that dog shit up for <laughs> you. The motherfucker who keeps leaving his dog shit in my yard, I'm gonna fucking punch you. All right, <laughs> listen. We are actually going to spin right now on the motherfucking ashtrays and action figures. The motherfucking first time ever. They call that gangster taking off a casket factory. And featuring. It's featuring the ROC and Lex the Hexmaster. Thank you for doing yes, that. I got you. We are going to put it down right now. That's a little special holiday treat for you to put in your stocking. We'll be right back after this.